Hey guys, it's me Kay. Sorry I haven't updated in quite a while, but I've been really busy. I'll explain later. So this is my two and a half gallon lily base, and as you can see, everything is growing like crazy. My crypts have just gotten grown into an absolute forest, which is awesome because normally they haven't been able to grow like that for me. And the three amigos are doing perfectly fine, being their little um entertaining selves. And the lily I ended up dividing because it was getting so big that it was blocking out light to itself, so it wasn't growing as well as it could be. So I ended up dividing it. So there's two lily plants in the base now. One larger one, one and then a couple smaller ones still attached to the bulb. And yeah, I know the water isn't the clearest, which makes me annoyed. But I've also been working on this uh, new project which I actually did last night at midnight because I roll that way and it started out just as my spare plants base bowl or whatever but I ended up actually doing some work on it let me see if I can actually get a carpet out of some plant I'm using Glosso let me see how that works I might add some DIY CO2 to it I also put one of my lily plants in there and I might add another other kind of dwarf lily I got in there, since I end up having two types now, but both are really small still. And this is my one and a half gallon shrimp tank. And ignore the air stone, it's not going to be there normally, but I've been battling some really bad algae problems, and I am now officially down to six shrimps which is one buried female and five males. It kind of sucks on the proportions, but I may put a couple of males of the males into the one gallon bowl I just showed you. And then I'm also working on this project, which is a five gallon tank from the 70s. And it's got a slate bottom, which, yes, I recorded this a little different a little bit after I actually took the video of it, so I have no idea what I was thinking when I actually took the video, but as you can see the frame is pretty rusted and I've been working on sanding it so I can get the rust off and I so far I have two of the sides done, but this is one that's one of the sides I did and that's another one of the sides I did and I don't know if you can tell, but they're so much cleaner and nicer looking than the other ones it just takes a bit of time for the sand, and then I'm going to paint them, and then I need to re-silicone it, and I don't know how the silicone is going to stick to the slate. I hope it works.